What's up guys, Manicator from the Hidden Levels back once again this time with Perk Attacked. I chose to play and pro this game because I've been craving a classic roller coaster tycoon experience for a while and uh, from the screenshots and you know all I've seen with the game is pretty much is you know <laughs> what what I've wanted. Especially from the games certain games lately which have come out, but uh, yeah, whatever. Perkitect is a business simulation game that charges you with the construction and management of theme parks, so, you know, theme park worlds, Rolokas Tycoon, that type of thing. Developed and published by Texel Raptor, Perkitect is set to be released in early access on Steam on the 5th of May for the price of $17.99. More information about the game and hidden levels, all you have to do is click show more below the video, and I'll give you everything you need. I just have to stop briefly though and say that there is a pre-alpha version, so it's a game that's still in development, the updates every month, there may be bugs, glitches and it's not the finished product. The reason they turned to Steam Early Access is that they are now at the stage where they love consumer feedback and the data that Early Access provides them is invaluable in helping them create the best game they can. So I'm going to give you a short preview of the game, a little taste to see if you like it. So without much further ado. Architect. As you see, every month they'll probably update this now and give you all the updates and stuff which they do. They got the issue report and contacts down at the bottom right. So, right, so at the moment there's only sandbox mode, but they do plan on having, you know, career modes and a lot more to the game. Got no options. Then in the options, you know, we get all these cool options. We're gonna put that this 80 now. Right, let's get back into this new perk sandbox mode. So when you start, this is the only mode at the moment on on the sandbox mode. It's kind of you know you just start off a massive grid. I don't know why, but when you zoom out, right? Okay, controls are pretty easy to use, you know. Thank God. So. What we're going to do is, we've got several screens on the side, visualizers, you know, where you can show the grid, etc, etc. This is the average stats of the guest overview. Got the janitors, where you can hire staff, so we're going to hire, 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 hire. You know, the staff have different roles, janitor cleaner, the haulers move packages from this place here into your park. So this, this place acts like a kind of delivery. When you have like food shops, they'll post the, the ingredients you need for the food shops and the haulers will go to get them and then bring them in. Um, we've got the a name park, state, finances, graphs, you know, the usual. I shouldn't have been there. And then down here we've got the, I don't know what, uh, the <laughs> current happiness, money, etc, etc. So if we go to paths, we're going to click super easy to do which I'm so glad oh what am I doing now and we're gonna kind of you know get a little grid going wrong way don't ask me why I'm doing this I just because I can so by here we're gonna have like lots of shops and stuff balloons bubble tea burgers no do want candy cash machine because you know Cash machines are so important. Dun dun. Um, staff room, like kind of staff room. You press space and it kind of shifts it around like that. You see, so it's real easy to do. And again, the pass we can have employee pass only, which is you know, which we're gonna have here, so only employees will go. As I said, I'm so glad. It's so easy to place stuff down, and there's no you know real confusing aspects behind the game. Chinese food, cotton candy, hot dogs, because why not? Hot drinks, ice cream, information kiosk, mini donuts, pretzels, You see, this guy here now. Go away, you. Like this guy here, delivering condiments. So you gotta go in and give the boxes to the stores, and that's when they'll open up. So that's pretty cool. 
What do we get to? I think we have a row of toilets, I would suppose. Toilets are cool. Vending machines right next to them because that's only natural in a park like this. Umbrellas. Yes, please. We're going to have them kind of turning in like that. Umbrellas and balloons. Well, we already got the balloons there, so we're just going to have another um, snow cones because, you know, snow cones are very important. There we go. That's our kind of our more staff, they said. Higher. Higher. Oh my god, my voice sounded funny. Higher, higher, higher. Let's hide them all. And then, obviously, that's clicking stuff. It's only anything, once you click it, it kind of pops up in the middle. It would be really cool if you could uh, click it and, you know, ice cream. You can kind of change the prices, see all the, when you click on them, you know, the usual, see all the info and stuff. So I'm really glad about that. Boom, boom. Look at that guys, that's beautiful. So that's gonna be my shops and stuff. I don't know why I made so many shops or why I need so many shops. Just how it is. We have a swinging shop here. Swinging ship even, not a swinging shop. I think it'll be perfect just right here. The entrance, the exit. Then we go back into the, you know, building tabs. I always gotta make sure that my entrance, my queue is pretty long because you know otherwise it takes a while and we quickly in here and open it up and you know we can change the colours which is an awesome feature. So that's open now and people get on. So you know yeah this is Park Attack. I just wanted to give you a quick preview of the game. I still haven't managed to test out how to do kind of coaster rides now at the moment there. Kind of really difficult. We can load blueprints. Blueprints! Blueprints like this. Load. And I thank God for that because, you know, as I said, I was having much difficulty trying to... Trying to get them to work, as they say. Let's try and put this down here. See what happens. Look at that. That's beautiful. Beautiful. Of course, the exit. We're going to have the exit by here. And... The entrance. There we go. And we can open this one. Let's click with this. Click with this. We're going to test it. Go with your birds. But yeah, if you love the older. The classics roller coaster tycoons, you're gonna love this game. I know. So it's pretty early days already for it, so there's got a lot to build upon, which you know I'm very confident they will do. I'm just, you know, so excited about it. I'm so glad I got a review copy for it as well. So thanks, massive thanks to the guys for giving me a, a copy to go ahead and do this. You know, there's lots of stuff at the moment, although you know it's gonna be really, really cool when they add uh, new campaigns and such. So. Yeah, that's about it. That's the whole game so far. You can obviously do build lots more to it. But, you know, I don't want to spend about seven years doing the preview, just showing you the whole game. All the descriptions and links below will be updated. So thanks for watching. It's been a pleasure as always. Do consider hitting subscribe and checking out our website, www.hiddenlevels.com. We also stream us out of the day, twitch.tv forward slash hiddenlevels. Feel free to leave comments below and give this video a thumbs up or down, depending on if you enjoyed it. Thanks again, guys, and uh, I'll see you again soon. Kappa Kappa.